What's up guys, in today's video I'm going to be showing you what to do if your phone is randomly turning off by itself. So there are different factors that can cause the problem. Factor number one, some phones has a setting where you can set a time for your phone to turn off by itself. But sometimes guys, you can turn on that setting by mistake. So let me show you where you have to go on your phone to figure out if that setting is on. Guys, if your phone doesn't have the setting that I'm about to show you, just wait for the second factor, okay? So you don't have to do this. Okay, let's go. On your phone, let's go ahead and click on settings, then scroll down until you see battery and device care. Let's go ahead and click on that. Then let's go ahead and click on those three dots on top. Then let's go ahead and click on automation. And you will see these settings, auto restart, accept times. So that's the setting that is causing the problem. If that setting is on, on your phone, just turn it off and you will see your phone is gonna be good to go now let's go ahead with the second factor the factor number two when apps are not running properly on your phone sometimes we use app to make our phone faster like to free up memory ram to have a better battery to close up in the background or a regular app but right now i'm going to show you the best way to figure it out if there's an app causing the problem on your phone let's go okay guys to figure it out if there's an app on your phone causing the problem you know making your phone randomly turn off uh, by itself so what you need to do you're gonna put your phone on safe mode to do that you're gonna press the power button on your phone then you're gonna press the power off on your phone until you see this setting safe mode so you will see this setting on the screen now just press the setting safe mode your phone is gonna turn it back on automatically so you don't have to do anything else guys okay as you can see my phone says safe mode on the bottom so that means this phone right now the only apps are working the apps that come with the phone from the factory any apps that i downloaded on this phone right now are not working as you can see facebook it look great smart app it look great so that means guys only apps that come with the phone are allowed to be running when the phone is on safe mode so that means if you download any apps on your phone that is causing that problem your phone should be good to go right now so what you need to do just use your phone for like two hours three hours to see if your phone randomly is gonna be turning off by itself if you see your phone now is good you know it doesn't go off that means the problem is the app so what you need to do restart your phone Okay, now guys, as you can see, my phone doesn't say safe mode, you see? So that means my phone now is normally on. Hold on, let me unlock my phone. So now what you need to do guys, you're gonna click on settings, then scroll down. Let's go ahead and click on battery and device care. If you don't see device care on your phone, let's click on battery, okay? It's gonna be the same thing. Then let's go ahead and click on battery. Then let's go ahead and click on usage since last full charge. Okay, here you will have a statistic. So what you need to do, just uninstall the apps that you see are using a lot of battery. So if there's an app on top that you download on your phone and you see it's using a lot of battery, so that can be the app that is, you know, causing the problem on your phone. And that's because that app is constantly, you know, working on your phone, not the right way, so because that's the reason it's using a lot of battery. And all you need to do, guys, just open the app right here. For example, let me make an example of this one, the camera light sensor, and you will see on the top, uninstall the app. Just uninstall the app, restart your phone, you will see your phone is gonna be good to go, okay? Now, let's go with the third factor. And the third factor, guys, if you still got the same problem, it can be the battery. So battery issue. Or your phone got wet. So when your phone got wet, unfortunately, your phone has some physical damage inside that you know, is causing the problem. So you will have to take your phone to someone that can open your phone and see what's the problem inside. So you know what I mean? So that's not like a software issue. So you will have to replace any physical part on your phone that is damaged for you to fix your phone so that's all you need to do guys if you have any question please let me know and by the way don't forget to subscribe to my channel share this video see you next time